start paying to own. What you'll be paying is service charge, which is normal for you know the cleanliness of the place, for maintenance of utilities. But when I look at you, it looks like you don't want that. You want to get a chance to to come and start paying so that you own in future. <laughs> I'm not sure what you Mwanzi tena. See, there are your houses. You you because I'll give you an example. Forty three is it forty three or forty eight houses? Forty three. 43 houses will provide for us 1,975 units. What government would be so greedy to want those 43 again to pay like the 1,900? Governments don't exist to make profit. Our work is not, we're not a business. Ours is to serve our people. And so I made that very, in government it was a very unpopular decision. Because they said we're making others not look good. But it's not about looking good. I think it is justice. I think it is right that you then derive value from having been a tenant. And even those now who will come again as tenants will have something to hope for in future. That notwithstanding, I think you'll also have an opportunity because your families have also grown. Um, you, have, you know, there's a character, there are people you want to stay with. I know someone was saying, why don't you please also just, also the, for those in bungalows, just make for us martial arts, you know. There are many lots that will come. This is just lot one. Lot one is in 10 acres out of 100. 90 acres will be freed up. In those 90 acres, we have an opportunity to, you know, replan, to look at what else we can be able to, to do um, for you. The assurance I want you to have is that all our decisions are in the best interest of the people. I, I am sure no, none of my staff is eyeing any property there in terms of land. But they will also come and own houses. You know, Already even amongst you, there are many of our staff uh, who stay there. But they are Nairobians just like you are. And they'll have an opportunity to come and rent a house and uh, later own it or to buy units because we'll sell a certain number of units but we will not sell to you. So that is why we're giving you a letter of allotment. A letter of allotment is an ownership document. Uh, Mama, I must keep my word. Yo, Baru, ata siyezi badilisha. Ukisha chukua, it is nivo. You, it can stand in any court of law. It can be used in any, you know, uh, it, it is recognizable. It is recognizable. Ina, ina tambulika, na inonekana kweli, umepatiwa na umepata nafasi ya kuona nyumba hiyo